little hazy, but there's the peninsula of Baja. And up ahead is Gila, San Francisco, where we're going. Sailing pretty well right there. Still have our water bikes on for this sail. Anchor down in the Hay Rincon cell. Look at those cliffs. Deep water anchorage. Okay, this is why you don't have fresh water out in the anchorages. We get hundreds of bees. I caught a tuna, two tunas today, and this was the rag I rinsed off with fresh water. And also had a hose out here and dragged fresh water on the deck and they all came just as we anchored. I'm going to stay inside. They're flying all over the place. I was already stung the other anchorage like three times. As I was putting down the anchor, uh, driving into anchor, I got swarmed and stung. An interesting turn of events this morning. The ball that we use to mark where our anchor is has disappeared. I suspect the boat that left in the dark ran over it. So I'm going to go find out right now. We're about to move to another spot about four miles away. We are at Isla San Francisco right now and we're going to go to Isla San Jose and there's a nice mangrove we're going to explore later today. It got pulled Here's under by the chain. It got pulled under. Oh, it got pulled under by the chain. That's good. I guess we have a very high tide today. Holy cow, big eel here, big eel. What, what kind of eel? This is where we are. So we're just gonna walk around now. We're here at the hotel. And they're not letting us use the pool today because it's a little more crowded because of COVID. So no use of the pool, but we have wristbands. We can go to the restaurant. That's about it. We are leaving Candeleros Bay this morning where this resort is that we hung out in yesterday afternoon. And over there, they're going to pave a new big highway to the resort. Lots of money being spent here. And that's the island we're going to. It's only five nautical miles away. No wind, so we're probably going to bump it. In the new anchorage today. Bahia Marque. Marker. Marker. Marque. Marker. M A R Q U E R, I think. And some blue foot boobies we saw today, too. That could be some right there. We saw it right sitting on the edge of the sandbank. Gonna go look for some bighorn sheep. They're planted on this island. This is big. This is one of the cactus flowers. It looks like flesh. I think that's to attract the flies. Yeah. Wow. Amazing. There's a cardinal up there. This one is a very big cactus. And you're not very patient. He's got his butt to you. Yeah. He's right up near the top. I know, I have the three bushes there, so he should be coming up. There, and, he, there is. he is. Can you see him in the silhouette, people? The three bushes, there he is. Sorry, I'm zoomed in on my phone, so it's shaky. He's a big animal. Yeah. We just climbed up. <laughs> we just climbed up this cliff, up the goat path. You know, a couple of old goats going up the goat path. All the way up here. Leanne has no problem rock climbing or grappling. Walking on a trail, different story. She's doing very well. Okay, I climb back up to get the camera from Andrew. 
so he, I could take a picture of him coming down. Oh, sorry, breathing hard. We conquered the goat hills. Now we're all sweaty and bloody. There he is. Me. I sacrificed terribly. Me too, blood there. Now we just got to get through the prickle bushes once again. Oh, ah, trip. <laughs> this is the hardest part, going through these thorns. There, there's the goat path. More bushwhacking. Don't hang on to this handhold. And there's the cliff we went up and down. Now I'm getting even more war wounds going through the prickles. I've lost Andrew. He's not following my path. I'm not sure why. I got a good pathway. Uh, I have a good pathway, right? Where are you? Hurry, because I need water. All right, I'm at the end. And Andrew didn't follow me, so he's back there, but I need to get a drink. So once I get a drink, if he doesn't make it out, I'll go back for him. Okay, made it back. Whew, there's Andrew. After a little rest back at the boat, we go for a snorkel. Also on Isla Carmen, about a 10 mile passage. 